Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and how are you all doing? And welcome to my emoji a thon unwrap up. So, um, I have decided this year after I I don't remember where I I think I found out about the emoji a thon from Peter Likes Books, maybe. So I found out about the emoji a thon and I decided to participate. I have uh, chose this book, A Discovery of Witches, because it uh, fit four categories, I think. And, um, well, as you understand from the name, I did not finish it. It's just, uh, it's too long. It's going to take me a little while to finish this book. So, well, well, this was my first ever readathon of any kind. Not a surprise I didn't make it. Plus, I think I started a bit too late, but anyway, since this is an unreadathon and I didn't finish, I can't really tell you much, but I decided to tell you what I thought of this readathon then. So, uh, I, I know there's a lot of readathons. Um, I chose this one because it seems easy. At least I thought so. Some of the categories confused me. But, um,. I decided from this experience that I will probably uh, do so far only this readathon because it seems the easiest. I don't think I'm good with reading, with pressured reading. You know, there's a readathon, come on, you have, you have to get moving. I don't think that's for me, so I'm just, I'm going to stick to this one though because I think it's very cute. Then could be easily stuffed into one or two books like this one. So, yeah, so we will, uh, next year I will start again, this time I will know about it, and I will start, you know, the 1st of June. So, that's it. Again, can't tell you much about the, the book, because I have not finished it. At least I, I, I won't finish it in June, that is for certain. I'm not going to, you know, speed read through it just to finish, so... That's it. This was my ever first readathon. It was nice. Uh, the categories are very cute. I am going to try again next year for sure. And we'll, we'll see. Maybe next year I'll succeed. I hope. That is all. Bye.